hundreds of military officers venturing out on the beach to tackle what's been deemed an ecological disaster. The Peruvian government is holding Spanish company Repsol responsible for a catastrophic oil spill along the coast of Lima, when some 6,000 barrels poured into the ocean last week. The country's president insisted Tuesday his government will be seeking reparations and possibly sanctions. From this point, I ratify my government's commitment to not only sanction this, but to also hold this Repsol responsible. This business must make payments to the residents for damages and it must fix the damage done to nature, the sea. The spill occurred when a Repsol tanker was unloading at the La Pampilla refinery, north of the capital. But the company called it an unforeseeable maritime phenomenon brought on by the aftermath of the Tonga volcano eruption, which caused massive surging waves. At an emergency meeting on Monday, Peru's prime minister said they've received input from a United Nations environmental team and didn't rule out suspending the firm's operations. These UN experts who've seen other accidents worldwide will surely be able to suggest what mechanisms there are in order for countries to sue companies who are responsible. The area is described as a marine biodiversity hotspot but thousands of bird, fish and sea mammals have washed up dead due to contamination and all fishing operations have been halted. The cleanup operation is expected to take until the end of February.